Welcome back. We are here again after 1000 years. Today we are here to explain the world. This is 911 International News Service. At this moment, I am drinking milk with some Kit Kat. Your mom is trying to scold you. Your dad is flying. Countries are being nonsense. United States is fighting with Chinese Communist Party for some nonsense. India is helping United States. Meanwhile, Communist China is trying to be joined with Russian Communist Soviets and North Korean government moderator. At this point of existence, grammar mistakes are very essential. India and China is fighting for a not decent area on both Northeast and Northwest India. North Korea is trying to be better than South Korea, they couldn't though. Israel and Palestine are struggling for religious places. Since Ukraine is becoming better, Russia is trying to take over. On the other hand, Microsoft is acquiring everything. Ads and bots on YouTube is increasing. All for auto verification badge system. Mark Zuckerberg is trying to do something different, so they basically changed their company name and trying to shape the metaverse, which is basically just VR chat. To be more and more digital. NFTs are being made based on blockchain technology of the cryptocurrency Ethereum. To stop nonsense of the world, COVID-19 came and 8 millions of people. Then again, the world is running like a pig. Why? Just, why? This is not good enough. We are in peace doesn't mean that World War III won't break out. To give more attention on females and just giving them rights, the world and its power is no more helping some boys. The situation is becoming cringier. Plus, to help the LGBTQIA community. Straight people are being harassed and not being cared. The proverb is actually true, that if you hate everyone equally, you are not racist. Anyways. Anime is being as cringe as your life. Just whites and weird voice lines. And yes, gotcha life too. Those shitty big heads in bad posture and TikToks only can master videos. No good quality animations. And yes, Genshin Impact. Talking about these games, I remember that STFU song by Joji. Ah, those Vine video and old YouTube days was very good. Now see. Vine got cancelled because some Chinese company by dance distracted you and built TikTok. They not only built this cringe, but also destroyed Vine. Now YouTube and TikTok is trying to become vice versa. TikTok is limiting up to 10 minutes video and YouTube is making hashtag shorts. PUBG and Free Fire is distracting East Pacific countries and trying to reach a billion of addicted players. Mobile game developers are putting more effort in advertisements than in the actual game, unlike the useless Danny. That's why, Matthew Johnson Patrick had to make a theory out of just advertisements. We don't even know that we are greedy. Take an example of Electronic Arts Studio. They built some classic legendary games. Now they are hunting down for money and ruining future generations whole career. Pyramids. What a great ancient age creation. Now, it is told that aliens made them instead of real humans. Here, my opinion is people were advanced enough at that time. But for foolishness, they were destroyed completely. Even king's tombs and the pyramids rotten. So, now we are advanced enough and bringing violence. Like, some pyramid reference got used in video game, that got used in some age restricted thing. Is that good? No. Violation. Argument. Fight. Destruction. People are believing religion is a problem. But no. The main problem is what people think about religion, and do by believing in a religion. The religions are good enough, but people are spoiling it by being just bored. The solution for everything, now is drinking milk, being peaceful, watching memes, having fun, staying hydrated, not wasting too much natural properties, not caring about war, not caring about what others have. Just care about what you have. And if you want, donate them all to poor in charity, just like a great person, Mr. Beast. End of the interview. See you in the next millennium. This is, 911 International News Service.